What's up my friends, welcome back, I'm Daily Fix, and we continue where I left off with the Terran Empire on Grand Admiral. So, uh, I, I was just talking about this here on Twitch, and uh, it's, it bugs me. It bugs me greatly that the, um, the servitudes uh, is just not working. We have some chanted slavery over here, which I am most likely... Can I, can I put you to residence? No. We are unable to change this for the uh, next few years. Having a few of these guys is not a big-ass problem, but still. Still, I don't know. I don't know. It just feels wrong. We're playing as the Terrans. We should be, you know, dominating everyone. Now, we're integrating the Norsian tribes. Uh, we vassalized the, uh, the Sonic Command. And I would like to finish this war. And we'll be vassalizing him. We're integrating them, of course. Uh, we got Robert April... And yeah, what you see, but what I'm trying to say is because this feels so weird, I I don't know what to do. It's um it's like it's it's missing it's missing its fun component component. It is the the Terran Empire is all about domination. Domination and and definitely just making the life of your uh, fellow galaxy members a bloody misery. So since we don't care about that, we are just going to be continuing, and we'll see, we'll see. Uh, somewhere around this night, uh, because, yeah, of course, you're watching this now on YouTube, but I'm also on Twitch. I'll probably flip games to EU4. I, I, I'm dying to play some EU4, it's been ages. Uh, for now, we will be focusing a tiny bit more on supplies. A lot more on alloys, trying to get some more unity, trying to boost researcher will become a absolutely tech giant. And uh, we'll just see how things go. Oh yeah, that's the last of my cold ass coffee. So let's on pause here. Let's go to the second speed. We've got some technology here, new uh, warp engines. Army damage plus 15, pulse phaser banks. Let's go for pulse phaser banks. Uh, apparently the, um, the Trill administration has opened their border because that's the smartest thing you can do, especially if we want to dominate. Um, you're actually receptive. Interesting. Acceptance would be negative 15, so they're actually quite close in becoming at least non-aggressive. And we don't care about that, of course. Demanding vassalization is a bit further off. So we could cut that number in half just by bordering them. And once we take these guys out, which we're of course now doing, that would be a thing. We could actually um, vassalize the trill and just see how that will go. Uh, also, uh, I'm going to do this uh, right now. So, uh, if we have leaders, right, and we have baseball, uh, baseball boy, he will always be in the series because I love his stories. He's been doing a lot of stories on on YouTube, and I love that. Anyone that is just popping into Twitch and saying something, I'm going to be adding him as a leader so I get some more. Hopefully, really, I'm gangs. Why? Why is that? Everyone is a resident. Uh, just to have a bit more of a thing going here on uh, on on Twitch. Crime on the world. Hmm. Yeah, I wish there was a, the crime lord deal. That would be so nice. Let's um, give it a bit of a focus here on anti-crime. Let's see, food we have plenty of. Let's do it like this. Let's fill up those uh, normal jobs right now. That will lower crime like a crazy, crazy person, which is cool. Why aren't you filling up? Why? What's wrong with being a factory worker? What is wrong with that? Just fill up those jobs. I would really like that. But it's not, it's not, it, it's fine. So what are you doing here? Why is there a fleet here? And how badly are we all hurt? Not too badly. Let's take the fleet down. Let's uh, send both of my fleets over there. Um, the NX class has been retired. And has probably will be replaced. But we still use the Defiant. The Defiant is such a strong vessel. Let us go for... New shuttles. New shuttles. 
Let's uh, right click to dismiss. What's your problem? So energy credits will be running out in a while. Supplies are a bit on the low side. So let's do a bit of a plus that itself. 10,000 of these. Buy a few more. And we could lower this. That will give us a tiny bit more energy. And our biggest problem is our naval capacity. Which, well, we definitely need to change. We definitely need to change that. And right now, we're 46 months away from continuing on domination. Not because I like it, but because I was forced to take it to get the domination or the vassalization options. While we are you integrating the Nausians. Yes. How long? I don't know. But it will happen eventually. Probably here in F2. Not really. Hmm, strange. I was kind of... No, it's not in here. Okay. Interesting. It is what it is. It is what it is. So, there is a bit going on here. Let's uh, make sure that we take this leader. Oh, he jumped out. He bailed. He bailed on us. Let's beeline it right here and over to the capital. Uh, let's take a look here. Where are my armies? Armies are on four. So far, I apparently don't need my armies. Let's just send them over here so we can jump towards their capital once we take it. We do want to take it out. Uh, constitutional class, you're not doing anything. Well, we could just put you to work. Since, well, you're not doing anything, so why the hell not? Actually, why are you not doing anything? Survey this. And we should investigate this event thingy. I think that's important. We got the Valeria. Interesting. I guess. Uh, once we're strong enough, I do want to get as many as them vassalized. And slowly just see how the AI is handling all of this. So they're not spending anything. Let's see how we can actually change that. How much are you going to be uh, spending? AI, let's take a look here. 4K, it is going down. Is what are you going to be building? Not as much though. Not as much. So maybe 100 is a tiny bit of an overkill. Let's go to 50-50. At least we got a uh, semi-strong economy. Influence... If you're wondering, it is due to vassalization, integration, actually. The Norsian tribes, they uh, they had a bit of a few, few problems. We could um, guarantee your independence, but I kind of don't care about that. 4, throats may be I do want to kill of those Klingons. Yes. Uh, but first things first, we, we need to worry about this. Let's take a look. Are we attacking that station and how are we faring with it? Uh, we're doing quite well. Okay, so we don't need to worry about that. There is that one army again. Let's send one fleet. And the other one is just going to stay over here. And we'll send in the armies over An there. A new anomaly. Why not? Why the hell not? Let's do that. Combat. Yeah, fine. Why not? So, let's see. Is there a way for us to boost? Ah, uh, okay. So, we... I do want to change these eventually, just a tiny, tiny bit. Are we actually going to be finishing the domination tree? So, domination... It's really not that interesting. Governor, uh, governor leader cap? Yeah. Capital building and housing produced by one? Eh, okay, fine. A ruler level cap? Yeah. Um, this is the only thing that I find slightly interesting, and it, it is the tributaries give you more, more, and workers and slaves. Well, since servitude is broken, <laughs> we don't have slaves. Yes, I know, I know. You, you Terran, how could you not have slaves? Well, it's because they just, just, just are more of a nuisance to have, since they don't fill specialized jobs, and that is extremely annoying. So, shall we just go for... Hmm, trained officers. Tile blockers I don't care about. Starbase maintenance would be nice. 
Admin cap plus 20. Well, that's not going to do us anything. And um, what's this? Starbase influence cost. Starbase capacity is increased by 3. Now that is interesting. Max districts. Harmony. Hmm. Population food. Well, we'll make more than enough. I don't care about it. Uh, increased monthly influence. That is quite good. Monthly unity by 15%. Stability plus 10, which is quite good. Population amenities. Demolition time. Yeah, that would be nice. One servitude is fixed again. We could, we, we, we could work. We, this could work. How about this? Peacekeeping a martyr. Happiness of all. How does this do anything with a martyr? You know, just do something for ships. But it's doing happiness for population. Yay. Well, happiness is also important. So how many maybe? Diplomacy. Do we actually care about that? Trade protection. Trade value. Border friction. Home territory firing rate. That is interesting. Ship building speed. That is also interesting. Trust cap. Nah. Nah. Uh, probably. We'll, we'll just start harmony and we'll see what happens. Let's just continue. So, yo. And yo. We're going to be um, scissoring this, uh, this one fleet. And he might be jumping out again. He's probably going to be jumping out again. Little we can do about that, but yes, we do have that, uh, the capital of them. Let's put you on aggressive, and you are now moving in range of the capital planet. I love that option. That is actually really tight. I like it. I like it. So, you need some housing. Victory shall be ours. Yes, victory shall be ours. What are you making? Guard barracks. Interesting. Why? It's an upgrade building. No. Penal colony. Oh, that is interesting. That's actually quite good. Get the crime lower. We have more than enough. Crime. Dilithium. Ooh. Maybe it would be interesting. Let's just see. Once we have more housing. So, right now we have uh, criminals apparently over here. They're all criminals. Alien scum. There we go. We got a few more. What the hell is this? Subjugation has been done. There we go. As part of the Terran Empire's ongoing expansion efforts. The first group of slaves of Norsean species have been secured by the Imperial Marines. Just the way we like it. And a lot of them. Apparently, I have done a shit on. <laughs> okay, so let's let's take a look how we can fix this. We are way over our limit. Uh, do we care about you? No. Let's see. How about you? So we can have two more stations, which should be fully, fully on anchoring. Uh, I don't, I don't understand. Why don't you build modules? That is so strange. But then again, let's go Naval Depot. Let's go Naval Depot. We'll go for... Upgrade. And a, another upgrade over there. There are a bit of a... There's a bit of a riot going on. It's probably species. Are you slaves again? Nauseans. Yes, you are. I do need to fix that. I do need to change that. I don't want to change it. But I have to. And I can't until we hit 10 years. That is awfully awkward. It's going to be fine. It is going to be. So where is the unrest? Nausea. Let's take a look here. Population. We need at least a few rulers over here. Let's just send some Terrans. Uh, we don't want you to be those kind of... a workers actually and uh, you should now be rulers that should help with the stability and we'll bring the crime down at some point how are we going to live for such a long as time police station what kind of jobs do we have over here so specialist is down hmm Is there anything that we need? Well, we could do a negative, a negative booth. 
It does improve on the stability though. So right now I would like to be focusing on a few more security officers. We could actually resettle most of these pops to somewhere else. Uh, even though they are just a bunch of slaves at the moment, eventually they shall be a bit more free. Let's take a look. We have so many jobs open. It's not even funny at the moment. One, two, three, four. Let's decline that. And let's get a bunch of Orion farmers over there. Decline you. Other planet. 14 of you and the noble here. Aye, aye, aye. One, two, three. So many are just getting unemployed. And the numbers keep increasing because the Denoblans are just pushing them off. So to offset this once again, we'll have to do the most annoying thing. And that is just doing this. And now they will fill up with the right species. And we'll make this planet a lot more stable. Probably the crime will die out relatively soon with the stability as high as that. We need to go to 8-2. Man. Okay, so he is actually growing Terrans. I will have to deal with the, uh, the low stability. I'm, I don't want to be uh, bothering with all of that. It's just annoying. It's just annoying. But we integrated another species. And we'll probably keep uh, the other vessels around. As long as he keeps being loyal, I have absolutely no problem with him. So we're making plus 8 on the influence tree again, which is good. You should be fighting that station and winning. You are fighting that station. That is absolutely fantastic. And we took that one planet down. There is actually no other planets in sight. It's a shame. It is a bloody shame. Let's start sending you over. The systems. You're on aggressive, which is good. And once you're done, and that works actually best if you just, you know. Oh wait, there's one more thing. We have a ruler here, Nausea. Yeah, I thought so. I thought I was uh, forgetting something. Uh, let's add you on. Let's not clear that out. Let's turn you on. You on. How many did I turn off? How many planets actually did I get? Hey, I'm happy about it. Semi. Semi happy. As long as the uh, the AI is doing its, its job, I'm happy. At uh, the minute it just doesn't. Yeah, we got a bit of an issue then. <laughs> I don't like it when it doesn't. I, I really, I don't like planetary management at all. I am more of a warring person. Yes. I know, it's strange. How could you be like that? Let us recruit. Low leader cost. And go with the doctors produce. I guess. Put you on all. And that should help. I will probably see a lot of these. Yeah, that just dropped like a brick. <laughs> okay. So we'll have to deal with the nauseans for a while. And yeah. It's not going to be changing that easily actually. You are going towards this planet. Can we take this route please? So we actually do aim to be a bit productive. Who's actually in command of that? Baseball boy, yes. Baseball boy, I'm sending you and your fleet into the next area. Hopefully you will enjoy. Let's see, stability is low. I'll keep this message on so it does remind me. Uh, the naval capacity has changed already. Let's make sure that we keep on changing that observatories. Wait, really? Where? No, 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 no. Can we... 
Yeah, let's indoctrinate him. I don't care for the uh, the additional research. Let's indoctrinate them, and hopefully we will welcome them into the empire. Yes. So you're done. And what is this thing then? Isn't this the the right kind of a? I don't think so. Situation log update. Let's take a look. No, it's this one. Their ship was lost seen in the vicinity. Okay. Enter orbit of Ross. So we need to enter orbit. And what will happen? There's a bit of a lag going on. So something is about to happen. The swarm is happening. Oh damn. Yeah that doesn't look good here for Isabella. Ay ay ay. So, entering the orbit of Ultimate, the USS Defiant, under Captain Isabel detects a uh, what appears to be a vessel of enormous size coming into view from what far seems from the far side of the planet. As the shape moves closer, it soon appears that it's actually composed of hundreds of smaller vessels flying in close formation. They must be stopped. Uh, hopefully they don't have shield, so that might come into... Mm, shield is dropping like a brick though. Will they be able to manage? I do not know. Why is there a colony ship idling? Can we use you? The ISS invader? Sure, invade that planet right now. Let's take a look. That goes well. I'm really worried. I'm really worried about that. Uh, Demons of the Air and Darkness. Excellent. At a... The Iconian Gateway? The Iconian Gateway? Oh, damn. Where the hell is that? So, the Iconian Gateway is somewhere in the system. No, I can't say. I'll be, I'm thrilled about that. No, no. Where is the Iconian Gateway? Mm. Do we see it? I do not. So what can we do with you now? Since we are bordering you. Can I not say I want you as a vessel? Probably not. Are you building ships? Why do you not build ships? I'll probably have to ask that in the uh, the community of the... Uh, actually, the Discord community. <clears throat> but uh, let, let's take a look here first. The beta. Yeah, it is here. Strange. Oh, man. Will they spawn there then? Interesting, I do not know. Oh wow. Yeah, it, it needs to go. Retreat. The flagship was destroyed. Ah, it was about time that was going to happen. We have 6.8k. We'll start construction of the newest flagship. Actually, we've got a bunch of uh, new ships. Mm, Semi-cool. Can we go more on the aggressive side? Let's go with the tactical station. Let's see. This was going to be crew quarters. How is the power? For? Let's auto complete that tracking. Interesting. We were we got war oh wow, emergency warp of emer emergency FTL jump cooldown. Come with disengagement chance. Interesting. So they can't jump out as strong. I, I like that. Let's put on more aggressiveness. Yeah, looks good. Nom 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 nom. Hello, Wenek. How are you doing today? Let's auto upgrade you. Let's save the Hoover. And we have what appears to be an extremely cool looking ship. 
crew quarters, also FTL inhibitors. Just woke up. Oh, you woke up. Yeah, dude. Yeah, actually, you look fine. Let's do this. Uh, I kind of want to change the tactical station, though. There you go. Where is... Um, actually, we should get the uh, the building of the... Uh, of the flagship relatively soon. Love the look of this, though. I do want to get more... On this side, you'll probably get tracking crew quarters. Hyper jump charger. This is the discovery. This is the discovery. Interesting. That's so, that looks so cool. Section 31 squad? I didn't know we had that as the uh, the mirrored uh, the mirrored universe. I like that the crossfield, interesting name. So yeah. So we still can't build the other flagship. So uh, let me um, for those of you watching watching this on YouTube, I'm taking a break here. Uh, watching on Twitch, stick around. We'll have a bit of a talk on, on what the hell is going on. 